like, I'm Megan if you don't know me, and I'm here to get you up on your feet and to get you moving. Now, sometimes we just don't feel like it, right? I'm just the same as you, but it's not so much about the motivation because the motivation will disappear. That is a given. It's about having that dedication and that desire to reach those goals that you have set yourself. So with that desire, with that dedication, with all of the things, the tools that you have, you are going to get up today and you are going to work out with me. Now I'm going to keep it simple. I'm not going to do hit or Tabata. I'm going to use a step and I'm going to use hand weights and I'm going to mix it all together. So if you don't have hand weights, grab some tins of food, bottles of water, whatever you want, or just do the movements. You don't need equipment. You can still do these exercises without hand weights. With a step, if you don't have a step, that's fine too. You can do the same movements on a flat surface, so just on the floor. This is about making it work for you. This is about making sure that you're still able to adapt things to get a good workout in. But I don't wanna to talk too much. I just want to get into it and get started. We will have a warm up because it's so important to warm up and at the end we will have a cool down. Those two components of a workout are just as important as the middle part, which is your workout. You wanna make sure that you are warm up, you warm up and that your body and your joints and your muscles and everything is nice and warm and ready to go. And then at the end, you wanna stretch those muscles out long and lean so they don't bunch up and start hurting and become weak. You also want to make sure that your heart rate comes down very slowly and not all at once. It just puts too much strain and stress on your heart and that's not something that your heart needs or you need at all. Um, also make sure you have a drink hand close by. Um, the music will not stop, it'll just continuously go. If you need to take a break to have a drink, take a break and have a drink, pause the video. That's the beauty of this. You are allowed to pause it, go do anything you need to do, come back to it. You don't even have to do the whole thing in one big block. Yes, it's only 30 minutes, but sometimes life happens and you may need to go off and do something else. Just come back to it when you can, as long as you do come back to it and get up and get moving again. But we'll get the music going. We're gonna stand up on our feet. Yeah, um, and we're gonna get ready to warm ourselves up. So up on your feet and start walking on the spot. Up we go. So we're just walking on the spot. You wanna pump those arms too. And this will also, if you start moving your arms, because they're closer to your heart, raise it a little bit higher, gets the blood pumping a bit more, and gets you warmer a lot quicker. You work with that little dance with it if you want. Little squats. So it's only a half squat. You're only warming up. Don't worry, I'll get you doing plenty of squats in our workout. Come up onto those toes. So squeeze the calf muscles, lift those heels. Good work. Okay, we're gonna walk. So you're just walking a normal walk. Well, not quite a normal one. Walk them out, nice and wide. Good work, arms out. Side to side, side. Shake. Woo! One more, either side. Now that opposite hand to foot. Reach down and across. Out 
knees, hands on knees, make those circles. Reverse it. Hands on hips, same thing, nice big circles. Reverse.
So be near your steps because we will use them. But we are going to just start off with our squat. So feet just outside hips, toes and knees pointed forwards, hips are square. You don't want to be twisted and out of alignment. Feet is going back, weights in the heels, wiggle the toes, push up and squeeze. Go!
Okay, one leg up the back, knees close together. Feel that stretch. Point out the front, toe up, tip from the waist, no pressure on the knees. up on you um you can see i got my sweat on <laughs> and i'm feeling a hundred times better now than i was before i got it done so it's so so important especially for our mental health to keep active and to keep active every single day our health is so important so do whatever you can do to be the healthiest fittest strongest most amazing person you can be remember to make healthy choices don't beat yourself up if you choose to have an ice cream or a chocolate or cake. You still need to live your life. Stay hydrated, so important. Even though the weather might be cooling down, we still need to make sure we are staying hydrated because our body needs that hydration. We're made up of mostly water. Keep moving your body. This was 30 minutes out of your whole day. So you have a whole lot of more time to get active. Make it fun, get your family involved, have 
have a laugh. That's the best thing you can do. Most importantly, keep being kind to yourself. Talk to yourself the way that you talk to a loved one. Treat yourself with the love and respect you deserve because you are amazing. I believe in you, so you start believing in you. But go and enjoy your day until I am back again. And I will be back again because I'm always back. I love doing this. This is my passion. Till then, take care of yourselves. Smile. The world will smile with you. And eventually, even if you're not quite feeling it at the time, you will start to smile again too. You're not alone. We're all here for you. And we're all going to get through this together. Maybe alone, but we will get through this together stronger. Until then, yeah. Thank you, guys.